much that needs to grow today. Rain, rain, please don't go away. Hi, I'm Susan Bryan with the Washtenaw County Water Resources Commissioner's Office, and I'm here with Katie Wajicek, who's holding the camera, and we are visiting a rain garden in winter. So here is um, a house. Where do you think the rain goes when it falls out of the sky? Right here. Well, one of the places it goes is it falls on this tree and the tree catches it and it also goes to the tree's roots and the tree sucks it up and puts it into the air. But what about if the rain falls on the roof? Let's see, where does that raindrop go? Let's follow that raindrop. Well, it goes into the gutter and then down that pipe all the way down all the way down this slope that keeps going down 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 let's follow it so it comes down here and you can see there's some ice here that's probably where the water goes all the way down and it goes right into this rain garden the rain garden catches it so right here all the water from the roof and this driveway goes into this rain garden and when it arrives there it might not be that clean because it's been picking up pollution from the asphalt uh, where cars may have dripped oils and things like that but once it gets into the rain garden the rain garden cleans it it soaks right into the soil now you might be thinking how does soil clean rainwater well it filters it a filter is often little granules and it catches a lot of those soil particles. Another thing that happens is that some of the microorganisms in the soil eat some of the petrochemicals. It's hard to believe, but they do. So the water goes into this rain garden and gets clean. So not everywhere has rain gardens. Some places the water just goes into the pipes underground and goes to our rivers, but it's not clean then. What about your yard? Think a little bit about where does the rain go in your yard? Okay, it's your turn. Go to your backyard, even in winter, it's okay. Go outside and figure out where does the water from your driveway and your roof, where does it go? Is there a place where you could put a rain garden? Thanks for listening. This is Susan Bryan with Washtenaw County Water Resources. Thanks. Hi everybody, I'm Katie, and I'm going to prove to you that you can put dirty water through a rain garden and it will come out clean. So Susan said all those little microorganisms in the soil will clean up all the dirty stormwater that rushes into a garden, but how exactly does that work? Well, let's see. So here we have our soil model. It's full of nice topsoil and then below that the native soil, which is kind of sandy. and we have our water sample. So here's our dirty water. We're gonna pour it through and there's all these little microorganisms in that soil that's eating the dirty water up and it's filtering our water clean. So we're gonna open up our nozzle and let some of that water come out and look at how much cleaner it came. It's not perfectly clean. You might not wanna drink it, but it's much, much cleaner. Thanks everybody. We're gonna read a comic strip with our guest speaker, Neil McKenna. Take it away, Neil. The Waste Watchers present, I was a teenage raindrop. I sure do love the sound of rain pattering off my roof, driveway and Olympic size hopscotch arena. I wonder what it would be like to be a drop of rainwater rushing all over the place, going wherever I want with no burdens or responsibilities. Whee, this is fun. Oof, ouch, ow. Gee, this driveway is rougher than I thought. And who are you guys? I'm Motor Oil and this is my buddy Antifreeze. We're both dropouts from Automotive Tech. Can we hitch a ride with you? Uh, okay, I guess. Finally, some soft grass. I could use a little rest. 
Keep it moving, pal. We gotta roll off of this pavement too. But, well, okay. Yikes, what a traffic jam. Well, maybe I can uh, rest for a while in this gutter. Ah, uh, oh, if only these guys would stop shoving. Splash. No, ah, oh, this water's moving too. Hey, where did you all come from? I'm Phosphorus of the fertilizer family, and these are the dude triplets, dog, cat, and raccoon. We ran into you on the lawn and decided to tag along. And I'm Dirt. I was minding my own business on the side of this gutter when you ran into me. I didn't want to go anywhere. What a bunch. Thank goodness we're finally coming to a storm drain. Maybe I can lose these guys and get a little elbow room. Oh, no! And so our dreaming hero is crowded through pipes, creeks, and rivers, rushing and pushing and picking up more and pleasant company along the way. Finally, at the lake... That was awful! Why does rain have to move so far, so fast? And why are all these fish staring at me? Oh, uh, all right. Much later... Hi, were you in that storm too? I just got here. But, but how is that possible? It's been days. You look so relaxed and clean. Well, I guess I took the scenic route. First, I bounced off the roof into a rain barrel where I made some friends. I say, careful to drop the old bubbly. It's an excellent vintage, last Thursday's rain. Then I was used to water a lawn, whee, which drained into a rain garden full of interesting hangouts and foliage rides. But I decided to seep, seep down into the ground instead. But if you seeped into the ground, then how did you end up here? Why aren't you covered with dirt? Yeah. Don't you know, even water that's under the ground is always moving somewhere. And since it's not in a hurry, it moves around dirt particles instead of knocking them loose. From underground, I meandered into a creek and then into a river. And then here. Wow, that's a long trip. Didn't you run into any of those creepy guys, these creepy guys along the way? A few, yeah, but they got scrubbed off underground or in some cases, microorganisms ate them. Well, I'm going to evaporate into a cloud and go around again. Have fun with your friends. Wait, uh, take me with you. Don't leave me. Look at you. Oh, oh you. it was all just a dream. Or was it? Next day. Why are you planting a garden where your hopscotch arena used to be? I decided to put in a different kind of entertainment. Something for a rainy day. Oh, water cycle evaporate, condensate, precipitate, and we do it again. Evaporate, condensate, precipitate, it has no end. Evaporate, condensate, precipitate, and we do it again. Evaporate, condensate, precipitate. It has no end, the water cycle keeps on going and going And all the rivers keep on flowing and flowing And all the kids keep on knowing and knowing That we love H2O